September. This special photo of a Topeka couple battling COVID-19 is very sweet and it also is bittersweet. That's because Sandy and Gary Schaffner's daughters hope that you see this photo, hear their story and take coronavirus seriously. This is a love story. August 13th would have been their 60th anniversary. Sandy and Gary Schaffner were a classic tale of opposites attract. My mom was one hell of a golfer. Dad sucked. He tried his hardest and it was so cute. Whereas dad's hobby and passion was fishing. Mom hated that, but she would go. Two strong personalities. Dad was always the calming soul to really all of us. And mom was a firecracker. Her feistiness is what made her who she is. Together in health, they loved to travel. They partied hard. They both loved the University of Kansas. And sickness. Sandy beat breast cancer and a severe brain injury. She had to learn to walk again. She had to learn to talk again. And in mid-June, both caught COVID-19. Gary got sick first with minor symptoms. In the span of six hours, everything just went to hell as his fever had spiked, his blood pressure had skyrocketed, his pulse ox had plummeted. Days later, Sandy fell ill too. They did nothing wrong. They were on lockdown since March. Um, it just happened. This couple who spent precious few days apart over the past six decades were now fighting for their lives, separated, no visitors allowed. Daughters Terry Mayhew and Stacy Vobach asked the administrators at Stormontville Hospital in Topeka if they'd make an exception for them to be together. They agreed. They lowered the bed rails. They pushed their beds together so they could hold hands. Terry posted this photo to Facebook, two faces of what for many is an invisible fight. Frustrated with the mask thing. I was frustrated with the people not believing COVID. And I just sat down and I thought, you know what? I'm going to share this photo. Maybe this picture of mom and dad is going to be, you know, it's going to drive the point home. Terry put up the photo Monday and thousands of people shared it. Tuesday afternoon, Gary Schaffner passed away, his beloved wife by his side. Wednesday evening, Sandy took her last breath as well. So she was fighting COVID, but ultimately, why do you feel your mom passed away? Broken heart. She, I mean, it was Gary and Sandy, partners for life. And so it's a blessing that they were both called home to, to heaven within 30 hours. What do you hope people take away from this story? This is real. This is reality. Please wear a mask. Please, if you're not feeling well, don't go outside. Not think about it as someone's telling you what to do. It's just the right thing to do. And I don't want any family to go through this pain of telling your loved ones goodbye via FaceTime. We don't wish this upon anyone. It, it, it is a brutal, brutal disease. And as much as they're dealing with loss, they hope everyone remembers the love. It's a relief. It played out how it did. And I'm at peace with that because they're together. The family calls the workers, the health care workers at Stormont Vale, the true heroes in this story. They say that they have to serve as the surrogate family members since loved ones aren't allowed at the bedside right now. So all of our best to the Schaffner family too.